Hey guys, Michael from Modulus here. Um, in my new little home studio, I've set up for recording some demos and just messing about with the recorded sounds. What we've got here today is the 2204 clone I built several months ago. And what we've got to do is we're going to swap out, or I have already swapped out, all the 500 Picaferro caps in the circuit and then just played through with a looper pedal so that's the same sample being played every time and hopefully be able to hear some differences between the different caps. Um, there's three in the signal chain and there's two different sound samples. There's one that's heavily driven, heavily compressed and there's one sound sample that's a strat and a bit, a bit more light drive sounds. Um, so this isn't really a case of you know this is what you should hear so the, the way I've laid it out is you'll get to hear the sound samples first and not be told what the caps are and if you go to the end of the video I'll tell you what each sound sample actually related to so kind of a blind test you can kind of take it that way anyway and see what see what you can make of it cool let's listen to them
<laughs> cool, so what did you think of that? Um, go back and have another listen to it really carefully if you can. A lot of the descriptive words people use online is grittiness or smoothness, um, these sorts of things people like to throw out. Um, me personally, I had one or two that I thought were a little bit better than the others, but really there was a, a ball here between them, is the expression you'd use. Um, there are other things other than just sound that you can use for choosing caps. So the polystyrene caps, which are little silver ones, they have a line around them. They're a rolled, and that indicates which side the outer foil is on. So if you believe that putting the outer foil to the lowest impedance side keeps noise out your signal, then that's a good way to go as well. Um, but then it's obviously price, and the price of these caps that I've used for the test here range anything from pound up to 12, 13, 14 pound per cap. So it depends on what you want to spend and what you think you're going to get out of it and the value you're happy to spend on it and the value of the whole amp you're actually building in the first place. Cool, I hope that was useful. Thanks guys. Cheers.